Hello and welcome back YouTube friends. My name is Alexia and I am back um, to give you guys an update on my Invisalign um, treatment. Um, as many of you guys know, um, I have a gap problem and back in September of 2017 I decided to go ahead and go for uh, Invisalign. Um, so as many of you guys may know, um, I was put on a, um, nine to 12 month, um, treatment and, um, we're in January. So it's been quite a while since I started my treatment. Um, as many of you guys may know, um, I had a problem with gaps and I just wanted to show you guys that I'm currently on uh, attachment 13 out of 24. And I just wanted to just kind of go over everything and just make, make this a short video, but at the same time, like let you guys know what my progress looks like and um, answer any of you of your questions. Um, so this is what they look like. I have them on right now. Um, I actually just got done eating right now, so I put them on. Um, I flossed my teeth and then I brushed my teeth. And of course, today um, I changed to attachment number 13. Um, so um, this is what it looks like. I just want to just kind of give you guys a little um, close up of what of what they look like now on and when I remove them. So this is what they look like now. I'm just going to wait for this vehicle to pass. Um, I'm parked outside my son's school. So, okay, this is what they look like now. As you can see, most of my gaps have slowly but not closed all the way yet so this is what the top looks like and this is what the bottom looks like okay that's with the aligners on now if you guys could excuse me I would like to go ahead and remove them and show you guys what they look like And it's been five months, you guys, so you guys will be able to see a difference from September all the way to January. So if you guys would excuse me, I'm going to go ahead and remove them so that you guys can see the real thing. Because remember, this is me having them on. But when I remove them, you guys are still going to see some of the gaps in there. So, But you'll see, you'll see a little bit of progress there. So I'm going to go ahead and remove them. a Kleenex here ready to to clean okay so this is what they look like now without the, the attachments okay as you guys can see I have a gap here 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 and here and then of course here Okay, so I still have quite a few uh, weeks to go. Right now I'm wearing them um, every two weeks. I'll go ahead and pop them back on. So I'm still wearing them every two weeks. But I'm due back with my orthodontist um, next month. And I will be wearing the, the remaining attachments, um, which is, let's see, 13, 4. I have two more left that they gave me. Because every time you go, I think they give you, well, my orthodontist. I don't know if you, if, 
if everyone's different but every time I go in for a checkup they give me six at a time they don't give me all 24 they give me six at a time so I have 13 14 and 15 uh, left before my next um, checkup and on my next checkup in February they're gonna give me the remaining attachments all the way to 24 so I'll be getting 13 I'll be getting 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. So that's a total of nine attachments that I will be getting next month. And then um, supposedly he said that I would be wearing those every week. So I'm just hoping and praying and praying and hoping that the treatment will will go a lot faster on my next um, visit and since I will be changing those out every week I'm hoping that they um, that they will show a better quicker results because right now I still have a couple of gaps left um, but you guys see the difference of wearing the uh, attachments and then not wearing the attachments and they're like super invisible so like no one knows that I'm wearing them right now no one unless like they get so close to me and then they notice that um, so I think it's a great deal um, I think you guys should invest in something like this because um, it's more of a sanitary thing versus getting you know like the regular um, uh, kids um, Bra um, braces where you know you cannot remove them you just have to like keep cleaning them and then food food gets stuck in your teeth and all well this is like more sanitary and then you can like take them off to eat and then like put them back on so but anyways enough talking about this um so if you guys have any questions i will be updating you guys uh, more when I get near uh, near done with my treatment and I will be showing you guys the before and after um, of my uh, treatment and remember guys I am on excuse me I am on attachment 13 out of 24 13 out of 24 so I still have um, a while to go um thank you for watching as always and um uh, if you have any questions please go ahead and comment down below if i know the answer i'll go ahead and uh, reply to your message or to your comment um yep so that's all and i will talk to y'all later bye have a good day like mom